Hey guys and welcome back to all new tutorial. This is Ketul Patel and today we are going to see that how we can uh, retrieve a data from database using PHP and we can convert the data to a JSON format using PHP. So let's start the tutorial. So uh, first of all we will create a database so uh, if you want to download this MySQL 5.5 version the link is in description you can just go there and download it so first command we will create a database so it is CR EAT create database say YouTube Let's skip all the small semicolon. So we have created a database named YouTube. Now we will use that database. So we will type use YouTube. So uh, now we are in the YouTube database. So we will create a table called demo with two fields one is name where care and, and another is mobile number or say we can say gender that is where care and so we are creating a table name demo if you uh, if it is not visible to you let me zoom it so here you can see we have created a database named youtube now we are uh, using that uh, database so use youtube and here is a query for create table demo name where care gender uh, name where care and gender also where care so we will store two three names in this name uh, attribute or variable or column and we will store the specific gender for that so let's hit enter so you can see the query is okay there is no error in it so let's type a query to insert the value in it so we will insert into demo where values is first let me put k2 and main so you can see one is inserted now let me add another that is demo and mail that is demo one female so we have inserted uh, three values in the table let's see if it is inserted select star from demo so yes uh, the field is clearly inserted the, that is k2 demo demo1 male male and female so now what we will do is we will uh, install the XAMPP uh, yes we are using XAMPP to run it and on the local host we are not hosting it on a web host if you want to know how XAMPP work how you can run a PHP code using XAMPP uh, it will be pretty much cleared by this video but uh, you can see it in my video which I have created for working of XAMPP and PHP the link is in description you can go and watch it so uh, if you want to download XAMPP that link is in description so just move to the htdocs folder in XAMPP now let's create a new folder called let's call it youtube and in youtube we will create a new file text document say index now for now keep it in uh, index.txt file so now let's write the code for php so what we will first do is 
we will write a code for php so let's name its title to say as mysql to json closing the head tag and starting body tag now let's write our php code for it so first we will create a variable connect that will store our database connection that is my sql i underscore connect so this is used to connect to the database so here we are running it on a local host so we will just type local host or you can type 172.0.0.10 now we will put our username that is root password that is 1234 and our database name that is youtube so our connect variable is ready now we will write a sql query So our SQL query will be same select star from demo. Now we will write a result variable where our result from this will be stored. So that is my SQL I underscore query. And our connect variable and our query that is stored in SQL variable. <clears throat> now we will create a JSON underscore array variable where we will create its type as array and we will create a while loop while dollar row is equal to my sql i underscore fetch underscore a s s o c and we will pass our result variable to it that is dollar result now inside while loop we will write dollar json underscore array bracket square brackets is equal to dollar row we will close our while loop and just will simply print it uh, for php you can write echo to print it so we'll print json underscore and code and pass our dollar json variable that is json underscore array and we will close our php tag and we will close our body tag also our html tag so we this is pretty much code this code is in the description link you can just go and copy paste that code now close it and change the file extension from txt to php so you can see that uh, we have changed it so we will just open xamp controller and start the apache for it wait until the apache starts so here you can see apache is started now open your chrome browser and type localhost slash youtube slash index dot php so you can see that our uh, all the three rows are in the json array from the sql database this is you can see k uh, the name ketul gender male name demo gender male name demo one and gender female same as our sql database uh, value which we have selected or inserted 
so this was how you can convert a uh, value from database to json array using php so this was pretty much for this video if you like this video press like button subscribe to the channel and if you have any doubt in any part of the video just comment down below i will try to get back to you soon thank you for watching